listen to my voice, Blaskovich. There you are now, inside sewage tunnels. The intestinal tracks of the city. And deeper below, the Berlin catacombs. A vast complex. The most secure site in all Berlin. The central munition stockpile of the Nazi regime. The things we could do with those weapons. Right. We revolt. This access route is water locked. Impenetrable to outsiders. There's only one way to breach across the perimeter. It's a tunnel glider. The Nazis use them for maintenance down there. We've been trying for years to bring it up to working order. This is the first phase of the plan to gain access to sets underwater safekeep. Use the tunnel glider to find a way into the weapons depot in the Berlin catacombs. Anya has agreed to track your position over the transponder and provide tactical support. Good luck, Sir Blaskovich. These are deep waters. William, can you hear me? You have to make your way all the way through the sewer tunnels and into the Berlin catacombs. I'll try to guide you through. All right, so hello everybody and welcome back to Wolfenstein, the new order. Uh, going into chapter, what is it, 10 now. Uh, we've almost got all of our perks, but they have this new collectible in here called Recordings that I'm assuming that we just get automatically as we play through this chapter because none of the guides I looked up had those in it. So I guess we'll see. Uh, also, holy crap, they actually gave Tekla. Now, the reason why the the scene with Tekla when I had the nap was so fucked in the last uh, part was because I actually recorded that while I was doing my collectibles guide. I didn't real I didn't know that sleeping in the bed would actually give you a cutscene. Otherwise, I would have done it in the Let's Play. Um, but I mean, there's only so much you can do. Okay, for that dis left or right stick to steer. Okay, that's, eh, I, I, I don't know. I don't like that I have the option to do one or the other. All right. Uh, apparently the collectibles in this part are pretty rough, but I can imagine. Uh, rough to describe, maybe, not so much to get. But anyway, oh god, I don't I don't like this. I, I feel like I should be using both sticks, but I don't, uh, anyway. I don't like that they gave me the option. Uh, but yeah, holy crap. And also, fucking BJ and Anya are goddamn animals. Like, good Christ. Yeah, I, I don't know why. So yeah, good god, I can see why. Really? Shocking. Oh god. Uh... Oh, here we are. Okay, I'm going to assume then that I have to exit this. Go through there. Some areas might be too narrow for the tunnel glider. You may have to swim. Thirteen years old. From the car by the stables. Came up cut off. Sure. Oh. Oh my god, BJ, just go. Oh, I see. You can't do your fast swim with your gun out. That makes sense. Alright. I mean, I don't know why the uh but yeah, anyway, I mean, I guess it makes sense that the, uh, that fucking PJ and Anya are doing it like that. Because, I mean, they don't know when they'll be back. The controls, once again, I don't know why it shouldn't be fucking me up, the fact that I can use both sticks. Because I don't have to, but I keep hitting both sticks and just, like, counteracting each other. Okay, so yeah, then she is just... Well, I mean, we may as well, right? 
Ramona writes, May 11th, 1940. I've only been back home for three days, and now the Nazis have arrived in town. They killed Jakub Brozek. He was shot in the head. His horse was blocking the road. He taught me how to French kiss. I'm going to do something about this situation. Uh, so yeah, I guess I'm guessing then that those will just keep popping up as we go. Um, I will say though, I'm glad. Uh, another reason why I'm glad we went with Fergus. I do like Fergus more than Wyatt, and like I said, uh, strategically, having the actual like hardened soldier makes more sense than the new kid. But now we got Tekla instead of the. Uh, I actually don't even know what the hell the black guy's name is. Okay. Um. Cause yeah, they went hard on like the. He's like the most stereotyped black person that there is. Not only is he, and not like good stereotypes necessarily either. I mean, he makes drugs. He gets BJ high. Uh, plays guitar, which I guess isn't necessarily a black thing, but you know. Um, oh, I see what I gotta do. And stop. Uh, and says that, you know, the Americans before World War II were just as bad as the Nazis, or they were the Nazis. Uh, which, I mean, isn't, to be fair, isn't far off. I mean, two black people, yes, they were, more or less. I mean, there was all you know, the slavery and everything, which is obviously not good. Um, I, I still don't think that they were as bad as the Nazis. I mean, it's, it's hard to say, right, because they were different, right? Like, the Nazis would... Well, no, they weren't as bad as the Nazis. They weren't killing somebody in the road because their horse blocked it. Uh, not right before World War II, anyway. I mean... Oh, fuck. That was my bad. I forgot that BJ doesn't know how to ladder, and if I turn to the side, he just walks off the ladder. Um, but yeah, they weren't... You know, they obviously they weren't good especially to black people, but I mean, they weren't Nazi. They were close, but not quite. I mean, I would argue that they were more Nazi-ish back before then. Ooh, what is this? Uh, RAF, Royal Air Force bomb raid damaged multiple residential quarters in central Berlin last night. The raid caused large fires, with some witnesses describing a sea of flames engulfing several houses. Early reports indicate that a dozen civilians have been killed and scores more badly injured. Several people have also been reported as missing after seeking shelter from the bombs. Alright. Um, do I get another lever thing here to turn the... Okay. Um, but yeah, I mean, I don't... I mean, I was really annoyed when he first started talking, and then I remembered, oh wait, World War II, right? That makes more sense. Because, um, I mean, to be fair, a lot of people nowadays, to be fair, not even black people nowadays, are acting like America, like Americans are basically Nazis. And like, where the, the cops are like, fucking Nazis and that, and it's like, that's not even close to being true anymore. Also, where the fuck did I get this gun? Okay. Whoop. Whoop. Oh my lord. Okay. Well, I mean, I got an idea. I don't care for it very much, but I do have one. But yeah, I didn't expect them to actually give, like, the characters... Now, that even makes it weirder that they bothered to, uh... To make two different characters, like Tekla and the other one. Whose name I don't remember because I skip all the cutscenes that are in the Wyatt timeline. Because <laughs> that's not my timeline, and the only reason I do it is for the armor upgrades. Um... But yeah, it's even weirder now that they've decided to give them a little bit more of a personality. Because, I mean, 
before that, oh, this is a door that you can. Why am I able to lockpick this? I am in the. Oh fuck me! I'm in the Wyatt timeline. Why am I in the Wyatt timeline? God damn it! Ugh. Well, you know what? Inlet. Oh, I don't care. What are the odds something's gonna come up that actually involves Wyatt or Fergus? I'm gonna assume then that through this door. Oh, but Fergus is. Oh, I don't know where the. Uh, I don't know where the armor upgrade is. Cause like the nice thing about. certain timelines is that they're for, yeah see this armor upgrade is way in here which fucking sucks god damn it I swear to god I switched to the Fergus timeline I fucking know I did uh, okay well I don't have a bomb this time but I do have an area I can swim through okay and I'm actually gonna because I realized that we weren't listening May 12, 1940. The Nazis have taken over the police station. They're asking local people to volunteer for service. I'm going to volunteer. I'm going to find a way to kill them. May 18, 1940. Daytime, I care for the sick working at the asylum. On the evenings, I go to town to prepare supper for the Nazis at the police station. They seem to trust me. I think I can lure one of them away. If I can get a Nazi alone, I think I can kill him. I have never killed anyone. I don't know how to fight or fire a weapon. I will have to be smart about it. I miss the university. Perhaps what I'm about to do will be a learning experience. June 25, 1940. The Nazi appears to have a very high opinion of his mother. I learned this as he was bleeding to death at the end of my knife in the outhouse next to the bakery. Mooty, mooty, he whimpered. My hands were shaking, nearly dropped my knife. I had told him I would kiss him, and he let me lead him outside into the night. November 29th, 1940. The Nazi appears to love his sausage. I learned this as he kept on eating his supper, even though the cyanide must have ruined the flavor. His eyes rolled back all white, yet he kept chewing. The cyanide I stole from my mother's cabinet. At times, I am struck with pangs of remorse. But then, I think of Jakub Brozek. Okay. Wow, that was her sister, eh? Page 19. Held down the well to salvage father's watch. But it wasn't as deep as this. Woohoo. I don't know why we're getting all this backstory of like the different times BJ went swimming. That seems like a very weird one. Okay, I feel like we definitely didn't come out of that correctly. Okay. Uh, but first things first. Oh, a Tesla one, though. Eh. The Tesla grenades kind of suck because you can't kill the robots with them. They might kill the little robots, actually. Come to think of it. There's an open door there that leads into this room that has a gold... Uh, like one of those Egyptian necklace things, I guess. Assuming I can... Opens from the other side. Um, interesting. Does that mean that, like, there's a way to get in there from this? I mean, I feel like you could definitely climb over that. He's not going to. Unless maybe I need to be... No, because I'll hit him. Yeah, that's definitely a light. So I won't be able to make that jump. I'm assuming that's why they have that light specifically there. Uh, let's see, can I see a chain or anything? I can... Oh yeah, we also got the strobe upgrade for this thing, so when I fire it, it disorients anybody who's in front of me. Man, BJ, I don't know how he learned to hotwire. Of a Nazi U boat. But first things first, see 
nice, there's a weapon upgrade. Wow, that's really far into this. Okay. Do, 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 up, go, over, and down. Now then, just because I refuse to, uh, or just because, like, I know that this thing runs out of juice fairly quickly. Do that. Okay, so I'm assuming that I just gotta follow the train and just watch my backside. Don't get fucking cranked by another one. May 29th, 1940. No, hang on. Eleanor writes, May 2nd, 1941. The Nazi appears to become sleepy after climaxing. I learned this as his little soldiers were leaking out of me onto his sheets, and his face turned blue. From the rope I applied to his neck in his slumber. Tomorrow is my 18th birthday. May 29th, 1941. The Nazi appears to have been brought up lazy. I've learned this when I outran three of them carrying a crate of grenades. I think I'm pregnant. I wish I knew how to use a gun. Oh my. Well then, I'm going to assume that the, uh... Recordings are going to be making a comeback at some point, and I feel like they're not going to be very happy recordings. Because, you know, can only assume that it was, you know, their previous, you know, see previous entry as to why pregnant. That's not good, I hear dog. Where are you, you Nazi prick? I see you. Go. That was the important bit. Now then, since I do have... Go, get rid of him, get rid of him, and then get a real gun. Ah, uh, fuck off, dog. An annoying piece of shit. Oh, didn't actually want to do a wheel, but that's fine. Uh, how do I not again? Nope, that's not the right one. There it is. Get you or not? I don't. I sure didn't. This is called the. Oh, I guess the light ammunition is the pistol, and uh, didn't I have an SMG or something at one point? Right? I think I did. I haven't had it for obviously a very long time, but I mean, I'm pretty sure I had one at some point. All right. So I think I took care of them. Obviously, it wasn't a very clean get through. Ah, oh, fuck you and your open other side. Obviously, yeah, not a very clean break, but I mean, oh well. Uh, point is, they're dead. That's what matters. Can I open this? No. What is this? Oh. Maybe I can open this. a little bit sturdier than I uh, originally thought. There we go. And he's dead. Alright. Okay, we'll put that down. That's a different gun than they normally carry. But we'll put that down. I'll go and see if I'll recharge this. a bunch of helmets and that around I should be able to get back up to at least close to a hundred I could also open up these crates but I really don't 
care enough to do it. I mean, I'm assuming that's why they uh, changed it in uh, the new Colossus. Because, like I said, in the new Colossus, when you uh, when you get to something like that and you fire an energy weapon, or when you fire their energy weapons at it in the next one, it just melts the entire thing. Whereas, obviously, this one doesn't. Which makes it super fucking annoying. Up. There we go. Some bullets. Shotgun shells, even though I don't have... Oh, there we go. That's nice. Uh, this one. Health. I guess I didn't really need that, but whatever. Oh, don't lift with your back, lift with your knees. Good to know that Nazis still apparently care about workplace safety. Alright, uh, up or down, up or down, up or down. Let's go up, although straight would probably get me to that other door that was locked from the other side, or opens from the other side. Trying to be fucking Dark Souls here with their shortcuts. Got a vent we can crawl through there. Ah, this looks like a control room. What do we got? We got some more ammo, some Enigma codes. What am I doing with this? Here we go. Our what is this? Oh, I had put it down. Gotcha. More ammo there. Health. I mean, I like that I keep getting shotgun shells, but... Oh, what? Ooh, that guy died. Ah, oh, so did that guy. Yeah, buddy. I'm kind of glad I brought this up here now. Ow, ow, ow. That guy's definitely behind me. Is it weird that when they're farther away, they're harder to hit? <laughs> you would think that with an automatic weapon like this, you know, distance would be my enemy. But, I mean, this thing is actually fairly fucking accurate over range. Like, can pick those guys off fairly easily. Can I just jump over this? going to assume that there's going to be more big guys at some point. Oh yeah, well, like I said. Oh, and that's empty. Alright, well. Oh, I can charge those as well. I did not know that. Oh, there's another big one. Okay, well let's... Oh my lord, alright, well that's a lot of big guys. Where the fuck was the goddamn... Okay, well I seem to have mi fucking lost... Lost my charging station at somewhere. I don't even know where I'm being shot from anymore. Where the fuck was the charging station? Like, I know there was one down there, and I spent way too long looking for it, which is why I died. But, like, I fucking know that there's a goddamn charging station down there. I've used it. Okay, let's hit the button. Pick up our gun. Our last little bit of ammo. Alright, well, let's see where this leads then, since we're here. Ugh. 
Okay. I don't know what the point to that is, but whatever. Okay, well, I mean, if I need armor, there's a good fucking spot. grenade. It is a grenade. I don't know how much the Tesla grenades do to things. Okay, well there goes one big guy. So that guy... Shotgun guy dead. Wow, these guys are seem really weak to the energy weapons. Okay, I need to get in here, thank you. And I need to not be dual wielding at the moment. Because he is rather far away. I don't know. Like I said, those guys are pretty fucking... Like, those guns are pretty fucking accurate at range. And without, like, a charging station... I mean, I can jump down there. Also, is this, these can't be, like, the first fucking shotgunners that I've come across, right? I see the big gun. I'm going for it. So I should at least be able to take out one of these guys. Maybe not. Good God. I see the charging station this time, though. And there's one right here. Come on. I'm assuming that those guys don't need to use the charging stations because they're like packs or fucking charging everything. Okay, is that it now? God, I hope so. What the hell is that? Armor, okay. Must have been off of one of these guys that I killed, I guess. Kind of wish you got more armor off of these guys, I mean. It's kind of sad that you get, like, at least, once again, that might be why they changed it in the Old Blood. But it's kind of sad that you, uh, get less for killing them quickly. You know, like, you kill them with headshots, but then you don't get any of the armor that they've, uh, that they've broken off. I also have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. I know I'm supposed to hijack a train. I have to assume that it's this one. Alright, there we go. Hey, we win. Once you board the U-boat, patch this thing into the communication room and raise the antenna booth. 